let me get your headline, John, on this. And, and let me hold up. This is the 36 pages that you got a hold of. Um, there we go. We'll center it for everybody at home to see and cover my face. I look better this way. Uh, but the question is, what is the headline you're getting out of this? And why is this document important? What does it tell us? Well, the president of the United States, Donald Trump, declassified this document just before he left office. I obtained it. It's the tasking orders. It's the FBI sitting with an informant telling him this is how we want you to spy on the Trump campaign. Here's a scenario. Here's our goal. If you don't get something from Carter Page, move on to Mike Flynn. If you don't get something from Mike Flynn, move on to George Papadopoulos. Every reporter that sits here and looks into the camera and says there was no spying, just read this document. Every person I've sent it to is, a, is this a spy document? And they say, <clears throat> absolutely. It's the roadmap for surveillance. So but, spying did occur. Minute, but, Let's just throw that one out the window. But these documents that Donald Trump declassified, uh, aren't they the tasking orders for FBI informant Stefan Halper to infiltrate the Trump campaign? Is that your interpretation absolutely. of this? It's, it's actually what they say. They say it flat out, what, they, what his job is to do. Get inside the Trump campaign and find out if they're colluding with Russia. Start with Carter Page, move on to Mike Flynn if you can get to him or Paul Manafort, and end up with George Papadopoulos. By the way, he then goes on to make recordings under the FBI supervision of people like Carter Page and George Papadopoulos, and they show that they're innocent. And the con investigation continues on anyways. It's really remarkable. And now the Clinton campaign are doing the same thing.